Welcome back, everybody. Hope you are all doing well again today. For it is time to take a look at the demo for Robocop Rogue City. This is being developed by Taeon and published by Nacon. Slated to be released on November the 2nd, 2023. I will leave a Steam link down below in the description in case you would like to wishlist it. Uh, possibly pick it up, depending on when you're seeing this, or try the demo yourself. Now, we're, I'm not sure when in the storyline this is taking place, but of course, we are going to be controlling Robocop, good old Officer Murphy, and we're going to be doing our best to handle, deliver, and serve justice in old Detroit. So let's jump right in and see what we are in for. New campaign. Now, this is a first person. RPG. I'm not sure if yet. We'll find out in just a few minutes if choices matter, but I'm sure either way, justice will be dealt. Mm, that OCP logo. I hope we get to blow up some Ed 209s. I always did like the way he looked. I don't know why. That was, that was my one of my favorite things. Of course, unlike some people, this is that's also how I get it introduced to Red Foreman. You give us three minutes, and we give you the world. Good evening. I'm Casey Wong. A military submarine that went missing over three years ago has suddenly reappeared in the Baltic Sea. Confused seamen mistakenly opened fire on the last Lapland reservation, killing 12. Jeez. Thankfully, our homesick sailors are back on U.S. soil. Welcome back, boys. In local news, a new crime wave that is sweeping Detroit has already claimed the lives of 21 police officers. Here's a statement from the head of OCP. Oh, still the old man. That's funding and running the Detroit Police Department. Old Detroit has a cancer. And that cancer is crime. It must be cut out, and OCP holds the skull. According to our sources, the attacks were aimed at catching the attention of a man whose identity remains unknown. This dangerous new guy in town seems to have his eye on doing business in old Detroit. Get your hands off me. Shut I'm sorry. Uh, there seems to be a... a, a disturbance? I'm a big fan. Now move. Yep. <clears throat> Winners do drugs. Jeez. Don't adjust your television sets. Your regularly scheduled program will be back shortly. Now this message goes out to the new guy in town. It seems that you're looking to spend some money in this great city of ours. I'm here to tell you that the Torchheads are open for business. You may have heard of us as the number one supplier of nuke in old Detroit. The most potent, addictive drug available in front of every convenience store, school, or library near you. But that's not all we're capable of. All right. So we got nuke from the, what, the second one? Or the Kane? Well, Kane was just a distributor. <clears throat> Officer Howard, to illustrate the point. You see, Officer Howard made a drug bust that cost us a lot of money. We want to reward this dutiful officer with a performance bonus. A lifetime supply of nuke. Are you going to OD him? Uh, you're going to have the time of your life. There you go. Enjoy. New guy. Us Torchheads are more than capable of doing whatever you need done in our city. So what is it, huh? Arson, smuggling, drug dealing, good old-fashioned murder. We do it all. You've got the money. We've got the power. So let's talk. Wow. That, that's an intro. <clears throat> Do 
Come on, Murphy. Come on, Lon. Murphy. See you, Murphy. Lieutenant's at the main entrance to the TV station. The ground's shaking. Judgment Day is here. Not bad, not bad. If you're out of trucks in this safety, just start shooting at anything that moves. I can see your lady is still Liquor, cigars. We're gonna get the I'll buy that for a dollar. I wouldn't bother. I already ran the plates. You should know by now when it comes to evidence, we're hoarders. Woof. Man, it's been a bloodbath, ain't it? Yeah, I had a neighbor used to have a kind of car like that. Or at least his parents did. Wow. All right. <clears throat> Maniacs have a ton of hostages. But, sir, under that, over and out. What is the situation? Goddamn OCP tells us to stand down till SWAT arrives. That's our situation. Looks like we're on the way out. Not so fast, buddy. Who do you think is going to clean up? Ah, oh, it is Lewis. I'm not letting you off that easily. <clears throat> you sound just like my wife. If that's the case, let's get you patched up. We wouldn't want to get on her bad side. Press here. Medic? There you are, partner. Lewis. The hell is going on up there? Mm. Sorry, dude. The police want us to release the hostages. I so no hard feelings. Oof. Hey, you, you can't go in yet. We need to wait for the reinforcements. Reinforcements have arrived. <laughs> I was waiting for say I am the reinforcements. We need to find another way. It is too dangerous to cross. For me. But you can take the heat. Go. I'll figure something out. Besides... You could do with a head start. Go on. Oh, yeah. I've got a secret for you. How much do you think I can get for it? Is it gold? Well, it takes an unpleasant scent. Just look in there. He looks kind of familiar. How do you not, how do you live in this city and not know who Robocop is? Drop it, scum. Oh, yeah. Oh.
Do I need to pick these up? Alright, so no jump. Not feeling a crouch. Can we blow limbs off? No. Okay. Doing so good, then all of a sudden I can't hit anything. Hint program. Flying ring around the rosies here. There you are. Oh, even does the swirl. Press H to repair. Oh, that's an F. Thousand. I I don't know how much Robocop weighs. Worried about the weight limit? Lois, you're here. We need to get these elevators back online. The service box is in the basement. Let me. I doubt you had time between all the heroics, but I got a key card from the janitor. It's good to do some real street work from time to time, you know. After you. <laughs> it's not like we're gonna it's gonna come out of our pay. They sabotage the elevators and staircase too. They obviously don't want to be disturbed. I guess we don't need to accidentally shoot Lewis just to see if she can take a hit. What is this? Stolen wallet. Graffiti is fresh. I bet some of those idiots are still here. I've reached okay, so heels. Gotcha. Nice. Keep them coming. What a warm welcome, don't you think? More evidence. You keep doing your thing, Lewis. I'm going to keep looking for evidence. Lewis, we got it. Oh, poor guy. Take it. 
whoever didn't make it. And program. What we got? Press right to use rope cut vision to invest in the individual objects. Okay. Nuke overdose. So they're ODing everybody. Eighty-five cents for a drink, man. Doctor, yes. Red Zio Fizz. Is that Bylit? Ooh, I'll take some repairs. Uh, actually. go I don't know if I should uh save that for oh or F oh nice Lewis where were you Punk, deal with it. All right, I'm dealing with it. Gotta say, I did not expect such a big crowd. Mm, ooh. Crunchy. Oh, hope you at least got to. I'm not supposed to be able to look at you. I guess that's only for certain, certain things. All right. Uh, H E. Of course, I'm. I'm pretty sure later on some of these guns that the better people have will be decent Give them a warm welcome. Lewis oh you're wearing something you were because it, it definitely will had a clinking noise so um all right so we put the gun out or nuke Use real quick vision to investigate the objects or people to find clues. Investigate the objects marked with question marks by looking at them. Got you. I am detecting a short circuit. You need to isolate the cable. I think I've got something just for that. Her and that gum. <clears throat> everyone in the studio it's on the 30th floor
decided to join our glamorous show. I'm afraid you're too late for my autograph. Chopper's ready. I've got to go, but the party hmm. goes on. Guys, make sure you provide all our guests with a decent amount of amusement, so don't skimp on the nuke. See ya. Wait, what? We need to be quick before they kill anyone else. I know that look, Murphy. You saw something, didn't you? We are here to enforce the law, Lewis. Let us yeah, he saw his real face. Just keep in mind that I'm here if you need me, partner. Shouldn't you be standing behind him? Slime bag detected. Just look at that, boys. The police dog and it's bitch. Not sure which one is which. <laughs> You're gonna take that back. Oh, you dented it. In my defense, that's a lot of hair. Fake IDs. Lewis, you behave yourself. I'm getting evidence. Like, oh my God, really? Uh, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Nice. Doing pictures. All right, while I'm doing this, let's go ahead and repair. Nuke. You know what? I want to, I want to hit a guy with a uh, computer monitor. Oh no. The heck? Oh, that's a disc. I could have sworn I saw you throw something. Lewis, that's not a good spot, girl. Easy ones first. Ah, so they are wearing metal helmets. Okay. Wait, what? And you're just leaving stuff all over the place for us. Lewis, you coming? one more uh, I thought there was one more
Oh yeah. That's a nice one. Plugs in the front. Let's check these rooms first. Oh. Uh, strong antidepressants. Punk forever. Before we open that, because that's definitely probably going to be. Uh, um, you know what? Yeah. These criminals who have taken hostage, you have only a few seconds to eliminate the threat and protect the innocent. Use your extraordinary reflexes to meet this challenge. All right, let's breach. Wait, hold on. Let's make sure I'm reloaded. Thank God you've come. This lady really needs to see a doctor. Murphy, these people need help. Why don't you go ahead? I'll stay with them. Right. This is Lewis. We have rescued three hostages. One with a gunshot wound to the abdomen. Requesting urgent medical assistance. Over. No, no, we're going back. I didn't check that room, Murphy. I guess I'm not going back to check that room. Fine. Um, I guess worst case scenario. Mm, that, that don't look so good. That almost looks like a trap. Get off of there, if you please. Marquez will burn you alive. Sure. Yeah, how'd that work out for you? any evidence here a lot of repair stuff so either I'm in for something big or I'm doing pretty good That wasn't ahead. 
really don't want to stand there looking around for stuff next to a propane tank. Boop, 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 boop. Some pretty interesting Yeah Stormtrooper noise. All right, so they're recording stuff here. We got here. Wake up Sean Studio interview. All right. Oh, we had names. Jess Parkins. Yes, Jerry Parkins. Explosions for Jerry's entrance. Oh, so we got cooking with flunkies. I don't think that turned out so well for him. He probably thought he was hiding better. Wallets. Um, this is where somebody comes to the door and starts shooting me in the back. What? Ah, camera equipment. Okay. Hmm. I like my robo gun better. Um, fully repaired. All right. Oh, so we could close it. Don't know why, but okay. <clears throat> Big open. Ow! I thought the trap was going to be down there. Oh, we're having memory flashbacks of our life. Whoa. James really looks up to you. He said in school that he wants to be a police officer just like his dad. Uh, I don't think there's going to be more evidence. I think we're just going to hit store. Uh oh. 
All right, <clears throat> here we go. Oh, you can even see the number on his gun. All right. I think we lost one hostage. Okay, one and a half hostage. I'm not dying here. Get me another one of those choppers, like the one that took soot. You hear me? You work so hard here. Why don't you take some leave? We all could use a little break from this reality, don't you think? Wakey, wakey! I'm talking to you, shiny! Stand back from that door, or I'll shoot her! I swear to nuke! I don't know what I would be if I ever lost you. You've got three seconds! Three! Our family is the only thing I need to be happy. Two! Are you fucking deaf? Honestly, it would stay like this forever. One! Last chance, weirdo! I love you so much, Alex. Lewis. You okay there, Murphy? What is that one? Get it away from me. I am sorry. Can't you see? It's unstable! Ma'am, please, calm down. It's been a very tough evening, and I assure you that everyone wants to be back home with their families. Though for some of us, the night has just begun. Hmm. Interesting. What you got next for us? I know there's going to be a nice cut scene of probably us being yelled at because of standing there and not responding or something to that nature. Sounds like a volcano went off or something out there. Hey, there's the chief. I can pay my bail now. Cash? No problem. Do you take soon votes? Get back in line. They're here. Good job, Murphy. I think you're forgetting someone. Officer Lewis, you were remarkable. Soot ran off with his tail between his legs. Would have been nice if we caught him, though. All right, all right. Are you done with this circle jerk, huh? Good. We've got a problem. We always have a problem in old Detroit. The malfunction caught on camera provokes a question. Can we put our safety into the hands of a machine? Especially one as unreliable as Robocop. We ask Max Becker, the head of security concepts at OCP. Now quiet! We would never put a defective product on the street. That's not what we do. We all saw it hesitate in a life and death situation. Why? Does it really know right from wrong? Listen, I would trust this guy with my kids. I mean, if I had any. This was just an isolated glitch. Thank you. Mr. Becker, I've got more questions. I just want to snap her little neck. But she's got a point. This was not an isolated incident. It's a pattern. 
pattern that the old man once examined and fixed. Time to see what's hiding in that metal head of yours. We know what's in Murphy's head. It's what's in yours that worries us. Push me, and you might just find out. You, follow me. Mm. <laughs> Fix this thing. Oh, I still got the crack. In my All right, no, no, no. We're not going anywhere till I do some looking. Major Motor City is the first city where the police are owned by a private corporation. Omni Consumer Products, a micro corporation specializes in security, space, healthcare, rehabilitation, military, and data storage and transfer. <clears throat> Says that they will not stop there. They are interested in taking over the police of other metro metro policies, including Baltimore and Chicago, where they have to offer excellent management and access to the latest technology. Well, let's convince more authorities to put their law enforcement forces in private hands. Hmm. <clears throat> mm. Try to see if we can find anyone we recognize. Um, I think last time was it. Didn't we go through there? Yeah, still the same precinct. All right. No, no, no. What if these are devs in some of these pictures? One. Probably detective corner. Ooh, what do we got over there? Oh, it's cool floppy. Uh, missing body, Nancy McGuire. Description event. Miss McGuire's husband body has gone missing during transport to Hawthorne's funeral home. Moreover, there is no information on such delivery in the funeral home's records. Additional comments. It's a third report on a missing cadaver this week. We need to look into it. Oh, you ate the pizza, you left your bananas. <clears throat> I was hoping to see stuff for Clarence, but oh well. All their gear. Get my helmet fixed. That little crack is. There's my favorite walking, talking law enforcement machine. Okay, let's get on with it. All right. <coughs> Enough sight, Sand. Why don't you take a seat for me? That's a nasty scar. I'd like to see the other guy. Am I right? You do not. Trust me. Don't mind me. I'll just get this off. So, here's the deal, Robo. The old man is not happy with your performance. Instead of sending you to the scrapyard, as I suggested, he wants to fix you. Hey, pretty boy. You sure know how to make an impression on the ladies. Doesn't it hurt him? Hurt? Lady, he's a machine. He's legally dead. We can do whatever we want with him. No, wow. It does not hurt me physically. So we're going to equip you with a little monitoring chip. It will do a real-time check of your system so we can get to the bottom of what the hell is wrong with you. From now on, your performance will be monitored and graded. So better be on your best behavior, huh? The chip is in. Let's see what we have here. Okay. And 
Yeah, we didn't get that because I know I saw at least the one shot. Okay. Each time you achieve a new level, you receive a skill point that can be used to develop your skills. Developing skills allow you to increase efficiency, obtain unique perks, and unlock favorable dialogue options. All right. Yeah, combat armor, vitality, engineering, focus, scanning, deduction, and psychology. All right. <laughs> okay, but weapon damage, I guess shock wave. Punch some a successful punch reloads all carried weapons. More powerful shock wave that instantly kills. Jeez. Damage reduction, reduces damage, received damage by 80% for a short time. Uh, ooh, dang. Health points, you can use fuse boxes to recover to 50% of your health. Increases the maximum number of OCP recovery charges to four. Ooh, all right, engineering. Hmm. Oh, can also reprogram enemy turrets. Okay. Hmm. Interesting scanning. Uh, lets you hit enemies behind cover by bouncing bullets off certain spots. Ooh. Okay, deduction. Scanning lets, uh, lets you more often detect helpful information such as safe combinations or discover hidden objects or even rooms. Okay, psychology. Lower requirements for dialogue options. Doubles earned public trust points. Highlights oh, favorable dialogue options. Not bad. Lower outcome. All right. Um, I, I like the armor idea. I'll, Activate that. All right, so it goes there. Reset. Okay, so we'll get 5% damage reduction. One more point, we get reduced received damage by 80% for a short time. Okay. I don't know what chip modification bonus means. Public tr that is doubles earned public trust points. That almost seems like extra experience for saving people and stuff like that. Or this would be more experience for finding evidence. Can I get more? Uh. Yes. Yep. Okay. Well, I can already see some unwanted activity near Hippocampus. We'll have to keep an eye on it. Other than that, everything seems to be installed correctly. To be sure, let's make a simple test to check that all circuits are in order. What are your prime directives? Serve the public trust. Protect yep. the innocent. Uphold the law. Okay, nothing disturbed. However, like with any new upgrade, I recommend visiting the range to check if you need calibration. Is that everything? Actually, no. Doctor? Oh, yes, sorry. Uh, my name is Dr. Olivia Blanche. I'm a police psychologist. I specialize in dealing with police officers suffering from emotional trauma. Emotional trauma. Might as well talk to the microwave. It hasn't been working properly either. <laughs> oh, wow. Be willing to have a talk with me as part of your evaluation. I noticed that a great deal of care has been put into making sure that your mechanical components work. However, one aspect of your composition that has been severely neglected is your human side. Oh, so you do. She at least recognizes that the brain of Murphy is still in there running. I agree. Do 
was up to me, I'd remove it altogether. What do you think, Doctor? Would save us a lot of hassle. I don't mind the hassle. So what do you say, Officer? Is that possibly something that could be of interest to you? I am not sure. Robo, Reed wants everyone in the briefing room in five. It's about the new guy. Excuse me, Dr. Blanche, but I am needed elsewhere. Uh, but we... Well, can't say we didn't try. Everyone get back to whatever the fuck you usually do around here. Yay, fixed screen. I can tell this story is going to be great. Uh, now here we all the dogs. What seems to be the problem? <sighs> My damn locker won't open. Can you try? Wait, what is all this shit doing in my locker? <laughs> they wanted me to be safe out there. Yeah, you guys, very fun. Wow. All right. More people are here. Hey, wouldn't isn't that the guy on the wanted poster? Oh, we gotta go downstairs. Okay. Oh, ho, ho. why do you have to spoil our fun all the time? You metal freak. All right, so and ask the question. No, I can't punch through and get him. Oh. Murphy, I heard you're scheduled for calibration. Step right up and press the button when you're ready. All right. <clears throat> what OCP calls a passing grade. Shouldn't be a problem to you. Break the record. Nah, I'm good. How do I stop? Good job. I'll let the egg hang right. Uh, see in the brief room. Good. I want to see if there's any neat guns. Uh, Hi, Murphy. I thought this. Yes, yeah, I remember. But well, you came in through here, didn't we? Come, move like all the way down. This was bigger, I think, and nicer. Can't be perfect though. It's been a, a while since I've seen the movie. So good. We're going. Oh, I guess we need to go upstairs here. Man, no, I just can't do it. There is so, no way. What's on today's agenda? Murphy, the agenda is hand? if you sit your ass down and listen. <clears throat> so it's no secret that crime has been on the rise ever since what the media has named the new guy in town showed up in the city. The word on the street is that he wants to spend a lot of money in old Detroit, and that has made every gang in the city start advertising their services. We need to find him before things get out of control. Where do we look? Our best bet is to see if he made contact with the torch head. Robo, I want you to start by checking the arcade downtown. It's become a high activity area for punks. Understood. Everyone else, keep your eyes open. Any questions? Any word on Briggs? What happened to Briggs? He's been missing since yesterday. Shit. Officer Briggs remains missing. 
That's over 24 hours since he's been in contact with anyone here. Are the two cases connected? No reason to assume so. But if anyone finds Briggs' informant, we might learn something new. All right, now get out there. You go ahead. All right. I need to write this report. And there's something else. That's Briggs, huh? All right. So I'm gonna guess back down. Cause I fixed. I remember their garage was under. Yeah. Mine better be reinforced. I'm a big boy. Yeah. All right. Gate's still there. Let me complain. Yeah. All right. Well. Actually, this looks like the thing from Ta what was, what was that show with Danny DeVito? Uh, was it Taxi? Kind of reminds me of that. You, you, you're doing something. What seems to be the problem, officer? Reed is in the briefing room, and I have my hands full. There are so many complaints filing in that I can't keep up. It's getting crazy in here. Could you open up another line and help me? I am here to serve the public trust. Take really? On the podium. You're a lifesaver, Robo. Oh my god. Please form an orderly queue. Officer, I have a problem. My neighbors are hostile towards me. I think it's because they're jealous of my new dog. Why would they get so worked up every time I take him for a walk? What is his name? He has a beautiful red coat, so I call him Fire. He likes to hide, so sometimes I have to yell, Fire! Fire! To find him. Anyway. You do something about my Oh my god, no wonder they're freaking out. Mm. Your behavior disrupts public order. I must issue a ticket. That's fine. I don't mind paying the price of having my cutest dog in all Detroit. Next, please. Oh, so I've held the law. Nice. All right. I know where you can find a wanted criminal. A poster over there says there's a reward for that information. And I want it. I want details. Are you blind? I'm the guy from that poster, so here I am. Now, give me the money. I will have to detain you. Fine, but I still get the reward, right? Mm. No. You cops don't appreciate honesty. Take him away. Next, please. Officer, I would like to report my son missing. How old is he? He's 24. But he's never been gone for so long without letting me know. How long has it been? Just over two days now. We do not consider an adult missing within 72 hours. Oh, please, I'm begging you. Something's not right. You really need to find him. What is his name and address? George Elkins, 7706 Orchard Avenue. Let me check. Your son was found dead two hours ago. What? Oh, no. <laughs> Ouch. Thanks for the help, Murphy. Not bad. All right. Well, we're going to head out and just see a quick cut scene. Oh, you, um... Uh... Why not? Well, you're on the way out. I can deal with blood.
blood, guts, but puke is a no-go for me. Oh, be a sport and move his ass to the drunk tank for me. You got your special gloves and extra protection, so you shouldn't mind. Uh, you know downstairs. I owe you one, Murphy. Oh no, the smell is following you. I'm gonna be sick. I don't remember getting on a. Go down here. Now that's the shooting range. Ah. Just toss him in one of the empty cells. Ah, uh, finally. <clears throat> Sleep tight. Nice. Well, we're going to come down here. Anyway. All right. Let's let's just take a real quick peek because I I mm, I like what I'm seeing. Feels nice. Little bit of the walking and he looks a little stiff when he walks, but that mm, You're gonna leave the area you And I do like the fact that it warns you it's like hey You need to do these before you leave if you want them done. I like that Because yes, I like to do side quests I also want to have really good armor where bullets ricochet off of me and hit other people. Yeah. <clears throat> Let's see how this looks real quick. Oh yeah. It'd be easier to burn it all, all, all to the ground. Believe me, just burn it all. I could do that. Okay, so I can hold a right and this stuff still lights up. Then down there. All right, why do you what, what do we got on TV, boys? Anything? I want to know why, what? Police officer, you can issue tickets for misdemeanors like public drinking and disorderly conduct or traffic violations. Hold right mouse to activate Robocop vision. Ah, okay, so that's why this was light up. Because you were parked in front of it. Got you. One parking ticket is all it takes. <laughs> Held the law. All right, so even though we've got our main quest, we can still walk around here and kind of. Can I? You please keep the noise down. You're can I come in here? I want to come in here. Can't hear you. Music's too loud. Good evening. Are those two men bothering you? First, they harass my customers, and then they threaten to burn down my shop. You need to do something about it, officer. What do you want, cop? Can't we have a little bit of fun? We did nothing wrong. If the music is too loud, my sound sensor measures 126 decibels. You are damaging your ears as we speak. Oh man, don't talk to me like that. I don't understand numbers. We are all the same. We are all the same. No, your volume control seems to be broken. Leave it! That's Let brand new! I've only stole... Thanks, officer.
All right, fr fruity loops. All right, what else we got in here? <clears throat> what we got for Legos? Caramel waffles. All right. Nice ice cream. Oh, I forgot to pull my right mouse button in there. Courthouse. Well, we're definitely not having night court here. Let me see about this. Uh, that's a clue. You say so. Got something. Whoa. Oh, something over here. Is that a person? Jolly Burger. Help, help. This rascal was trying to steal my cart. Look what he's done. Have I just wrecked your life savings? Tough shit, stinker. Antisocial behavior towards a fellow citizen can be classified as a crime. Uh, yes, give him a ticket for the future to save yourself the trouble. Clean up on the double. You can't do it. I was only messing. I could have just picked it all up. Hey, you tell him, robot man. What a fucking joke. Uh, I like this robo vision. Oh, what is what we got here? Oil leak. <laughs> yeah. One that likes yeah. Surely must be swimming in money. I'm earning. I. Well, she's just working. down there he's an ass what's this my times I gonna pick up that purse did you steal it hey buddy Let's look again, because I picked it up twice. Okay. So you can have stuff pretty much anywhere. <clears throat> All right. I, I can see us, I was, uh, see us having a lot of, I might finish this particular mission event. Ooh. God, and there's one there. More than, jeez. What we got here? What is this? Oh, the arcade. All right. Uh, let's do, let's just handle this real quick. <clears throat> See what we'll get into. Oh, crap. Give me back my money, you piece of shit. Don't you cops ever get bored with harassing successful entrepreneurs? Hey, this shit is rigged. 
Not for serious accusations, sir. Someone might think I would allow such illegal activity in my high-class business, which I do not. I get lost. You work for Soot. Tell me where to find him. You cops are giving me a stomach ulcer. Stop asking me about guys I don't know. Withholding information can lead to bigger trouble than a stomach ulcer. Look, I'm a busy man, so I'm going back to my office now. Why don't you join me there, and we'll talk. Oh, on second thought, you can't do that. Because you don't have a warrant, do you? No, but you invited me back. So, technically, I don't need a warrant because you invited me. What a douchebag. <clears throat> You look like you could be helpful. Have you witnessed the owner participating in any criminal activity? Are you kidding me? Half the things I've seen around here would be enough to put him behind bars for a decade. Let us hear your statement. No way, dude. He might be a douchebag, but if you lock him up, this place will get closed down and where am I supposed to play hooky then? Uh School may seem now like a difficult option, but it will pay off in the future. Future? Look on the street. You must have a microwave for a brain if you think that. Ooh, I want to play Crystal Knights. Sushi Smash? All right, so that probably ruined my chance of that. Coin pusher, what do we got here? Right. What you got? Oh, not you. They're gonna let me. Motion tech. <laughs> oh my god. Really? Slouching? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, hello. What have we here? Suit, my business partner. Recently, your men started to act, shall we say, unusually. We we're questioning each other about what it is to be a true torchhead. Like they're looking for a snitch, but they can't be one in such a thoughtful, managed criminal enterprise as yours. You're probably wondering why no cop came knocking after your live show, which, by the way, was truly great TV. You should know that the cops are afraid of you. Jostling among yourselves is bad for business. Maybe you could have a word with them. Just keep those productivity juices flowing, your humble partner. All right. Not that. You know what this reminds me of? The arcade room or little play area from the original Ninja Turtles. <clears throat> And we're throwing them all in together. What's wrong with you? Your body readings suggest substance misuse. Oh man, a real life TJ laser? You are so incredibly shiny. I am definitely getting more of this stuff. Who sold you drugs? I really shouldn't say, but you are my TV hero. All right, fine. Uh, all of the arcade staff will sell to you, as long as you got cash. Unfortunately, I'm broke, but I have a great idea. You, 
you could help me sneak into the basement? <laughs> Please, damn it. Drugs in the basement? I will take care of that. Did you really do that for me? Way to go, TJ! Where'd that guy go? Mm. <clears throat> There's one more person to talk to out or scan. Time to go knock knock. Open the door. I have the warrant. Oopsie. I think I dropped my key somewhere. You'd have to break down this hardened door if you want to get in. Okay. That will not be a problem. <laughs> oh, come on. I want to scan him. Uh, can I get my gun out? Surrender your weapons. I want to punch somebody. I want to see how that feels. Oh, that felt pretty good. I mean, that felt really nice. Are you behind? Oh. Anybody else want to come down the hallway in the middle? Be one more. All right, now, if you don't mind, right, grab all that stolen purse. What else we got? We're getting the nuke and the other stuff in here. Say nuke or get lost. <clears throat> Tell the buyers to stop using what made up names for nuke. Now this double cheese, anti in hot sauce, body bags, and red whatever. It only makes my guys confused, and that's bad for business. Pigs can't do crap, so there's no need to speak in code. These dope heads either buy a nuke or jack all. Lovely superstardom boss S. Those are some interesting bullets. I wonder why that did the little slow time thing there. Oh, are they playing some kind of war or battleship? I want to play. All right, let's breach it. Open the door or you will regret it. Can't, can't a guy just sell drugs to kids without you harassing him every five minutes? Who, who am I hurting, huh? They all want it. Where do I find soot? 
Well, if that's the case... Got it, bozo. Unless you want to end up in the ghost house like that cop's informant. And don't you dare open that door. I'll shoot you. One of you is not a real Torchette, but just an imitator. I knew there was something off about you. Me? It's you. I always suspected you never went through initiation. <laughs> <laughs> For fuck's sake, don't shoot. I'm going to open the door. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> so, okay, so we only got that because we found the note about the imposters. I like that. Straight to business, huh? Looks like you're my type of guy. But even if I wanted to help you, I can't. Only his closest people know his whereabouts. I just distribute his stuff. And to be completely honest, I don't want or need to know more than when the next shipment is coming. You must know the location they mentioned. Tell me where they took the police informant. And if I tell you, what's in it for me? Uh. Does everything you do have to come with a benefit? I'm a businessman. That's the only language I speak. How about the value of your life? Who would care more to save it, the police or soot? Let's say I'm convinced. But they've taken him to the ghost house. It's what they call one of their sites. From what I've gathered, it's that big burned down building a bit down the road. Anyway, that's all I know. That will have to suffice for now. <laughs> Not bad. All right, give me that. I need, I need experience. Uh. Take that. Why do you even have that? Uh, test, test, put an armored gate, installation. Oh, so he even got arrested. All right. All right, so we can't bust it open. I almost missed that. Dang, so I can't even get that? How do you have that? So, all right, so that we pushed the button. All right, where's the stay here? Dispatch requesting a squad car. Oh, okay. Mm, mm, mm. Training disc? Ooh, all right. Oh, hold on. So we got map, objectives. No printed circuit board of that. Ooh, so we can print up, get upgrades for our weapon. Nice. No archives. All right. Um, well, we needed to tuck deduction two, right? Yes. Let's go back here. We've still got a point to spare, so. Note with a safe code combination. All right. Does that mean I can open this now? Make money. That All right, all right. with the oh with the park point everyone 
mean, I don't mind holding on to that for right now. I have the feeling that something's about to... Uh, ooh, Night of Horrors. I almost expected that to blow up as he was leaving. Perfect. This is Reed. Mayor Kuzak just stormed into my office. Apparently, his niece's car has been stolen. Find it. This goes to the top of your priority list. You can start by asking about it at some of the local garages. For the record, it's a blue SUX 6000 registered to Melissa Kuzak. Hmm. Let's do a quick scan here. Doesn't look like anything has been added. Hey, I'll learn less if you hang around here. Uh, nothing's added there. You don't look so good, buddy. What happened to your nose? How can I assist you, officer? I'm trying to catch this one shifty dealer. This guy steals nuke from other pushers to sell it at half price. This dope head buys from him but won't tell me his whereabouts. I don't know any dealer. You were carrying for three different pushers, so you either like to walk for miles to buy nuke, or you appreciate a discount. Don't take it out on me because the guy broke your nose. As you can see, he doesn't want to cooperate. Uh, no. Do not worry. According to my directives, there are several ways to convince him to cooperate. <clears throat> I, I ain't gonna let it reprogram my brain. We can talk. But don't let it drill into my head, okay? <laughs> <laughs> but I don't know where to find him. I always arrange a place over a payphone. I'll give you the number. Let's hope it works. The dealer knows where the others had their stash. We could collect nuke from the whole neighborhood if we get to him. I will take care of it. But you need to find a payphone first. Try near the supermarket. I think at least one of them hasn't been smashed by vandals yet. All right. I can sit here all night and keep on going. I almost need to just put the Firebird on there. Unless this is a Camaro. Got the Knight Rider thing going on. Whoa, whoa, just hit me all their... Other license plates are barcodes in this. I didn't register at first. Nice. I, I like that. That lights up. All right. Well, this is a first look at Robocop Rogue City. I like the way it feels. Gun, very punchy and powerful. I'm sure that's going to change as we get to the, the higher ups, but I'm, I'm sure certain buffs and upgrades will very much sort that out and i like all the little quests and what you can do to to site order it and these can be fun i like it and the, the deduction and the stuff like that that was really interesting if you're paying attention so it's like look around pay stuff and you know advance things very very interesting i can't wait to see what we can do with the gun i want to know 
but that is going to get us for today. Next time, I'm sure I will find us something else interesting to take a look at, and I hope you will enjoy it as much as I have enjoyed this. So until next time, I hope you have a good day. Good afternoon, whichever the case might be. And until then, I shall see you all on the flip side.